everyone, so today's video is going to be on this Christmas, New Year's Eve glam kind of makeup and the outfit as well. And um, this is actually a collab video with my good friend here um, on YouTube called Nazra and I uh, just absolutely love her channel and her as well. She's just so sweet and really supportive and here's her video. She just looks absolutely gorgeous. I mean, look at her. Let's just pause a minute. <laughs> Anyways, please go show her some love and some support. Go subscribe to her channel. I'll leave a link in the info box. And yeah, let's just get straight into this video. So the first thing that I'm going to do is, well, kind of hydrate my face with this Mario Badescu Rose Water Spray. And um, I already did moisturize my skin with my Garnier Moisture Match Cream as well. I then grabbed my Sleek Bare Kissed Illuminator in Monaco that I recently purchased and this is a tip that I got from the makeup artist that works with Kylie Jenner. They actually highlight her face um, under her foundation like on the cheekbones and on the forehead and stuff before the foundation step so I'm just doing that there. And then here I'm just quickly colour co color correcting and um, I put way too much so you really don't need this much. The tiniest amount goes uh, such a long way so I'm just going around my mouth area and under my eyes as well. When I'm done with that I just apply my foundation. I'm using the Revlon Color Stay for normal to dry skin and I'm in the shade Toast. And I just uh, like to use my Real Techniques sponge at the moment. Um, I've gone back to it from the Beauty Blender but I absolutely love both anyways. But I'm just really blending that out and kind of going over it. I applied like a second layer under my eyes and around my mouth as well just to cover the orange a bit. And for concealer I am going to use the NYX Gotcha Covered Concealer. Um, that has kind of a, like a dewy finish but if you set it really nicely with the powder it should be fine but I just absolutely love the shade and the coverage of this concealer. I'm in the shade golden and I'm just blending this with my sponge again. And then again I always use the um, yellow powder from my Makeup Revolution Ultra Contour Palette to set that in. Then grabbing my Morphe um, Jaclyn Hill Favourites palette, I'm going to use this orange shade and really pack this onto my crease area. All the products in this video happen to be drugstore and I do consider this palette to be drugstore because um, the, you get so many shades for the price you're paying and the, the palette is just amazing and you pay around like £15 for a L'Oreal palette anyways. So um, yeah, I just love these shadows. And then I'm here, I'm taking the brown shade and applying this on my crease as well, kind of creating a gradient with the orange and blending that out nicely. And I'm also bringing it into the inner corner as well. A regular Morphe palette costs around £15 anyways, but I think this one is slightly more expensive because it was the limited edition one. But if you grab any of the other palettes, they're just um, really affordable for the quality of them. Then I grab this shimmery orange shade and pack, pack this on the centre of the eyelid and it just looks so pretty, I just love these colours together. I'm just fixing the eyeshadow up around the edges, I took a clean brush and kind of took the matte orange shade as well to fix up the edges. Then for my eyeliner, I'm taking the Maybelline Master Ink Matte Liquid Eyeliner and creating a simple wing. And then when I'm done with that, I just grab my Maybelline Lash Sensational Mascara and just apply a bunch of mascara on my lashes. Um, I do already have a eyeliner tutorial on my channel, so I'll try to link that in the info box for you guys, just in case you guys want to see that. I also did work go in with some falsies and applied the Ardell Wispies, they're the full on Wispies and I really love these lashes. And then taking my long lost love for the sleek <laughs> um, contour kit, I just um, contoured my skin. I haven't used this in so long but I really, I still like it but obviously I, I'm obsessed with the NYX bronzer at the moment still. And now we also went in with my mascara on my lower lashes.
Then to highlight my skin, I'm using the Makeup Revolution Radiant Lights in Glow, such an affordable highlighter. And then for my lips, I'm using the MAC Lipstick in Chili, it's a matte one. And I, it's like a orangey reddish shade, um, it's just perfect for Christmas or like the holiday season. Then I'm setting everything in with my Mario Badescu Rose Water Spray again. And then I, for like jewellery and stuff, I just um, bought a couple of like Primark stuff. This, is, this head piece is £3 only and I just thought it was so pretty and I just put this in my hair, I didn't brush it or anything because I really like my hair to be messy anyways. It's super easy to put on and it's actually quite sturdy and strong so it stays put. And then I put this necklace around my neck, this was £4, such a bargain in my opinion. And I just love necklaces like these and I thought it went with the outfit really well. So for the top I really don't know where it's from because I don't know, it's quite an old one I think but I just, I'm super casual anyway so I just put some Primark jeans or actually new look but I'll let you guys know in the info box. And then these are my Primark military boots and yeah most of it's Primark I think. But it's just a super simple outfit but then the top makes it a bit like glam so yeah I do hope you guys like it. But it's just really easy to glam up a simple outfit just with a really nice top or like jewellery or anything like that. But that's the finished look. I really hope you guys enjoyed it. Please go check out Nazra's video and subscribe to her. She's just so amazing and I'll see you next time. Bye guys. Hello everyone. So today I'm back with my sister for a new video and we're actually going to do the British Try American Candy. These